Good morning, Modern Steaders. Yeah, I'm gonna put some footage in from last night right here. Oh, guys, I can't make this stuff up. Look at all that darn rain. Check on that grass seed we planted the other day. I hope it's not all washed away. And the plan was to start raking again tomorrow. Look how foggy it is this morning. Last night we ended up getting just over an inch and a quarter of rain in like less than a half an hour. Oh, it was crazy. Oh, I know it. Let me go check on that pasture this morning and see if all those seeds washed out on us and then how the rest of it's looking and then hopefully we can still get it raked today. I locked up New York City. I had to put Andy inside the chicken coop because he was nesting out on the outside of the nesting boxes. So I wonder how they all did last night. Come on, Ed Sausage. Lynx. What? Look at all that rain we got. Watch out. Got your dish, come on. There, I just had to be a little bit smarter than the pigs and put some feed on the outside of the dish. Look at all that water. Just crazy. You can't get over how much rain. I know, guys. Looks like you need some more feed. <sighs> That's looking all washed out. It's not looking good for the pasture. Moose, how are we doing this morning? Oh, there you are. Ooh. I guess Moose is letting Andy know who boss is. You can't bring your cat to school with you, just to let you know. As much as you want to. Think your teacher will like him? Um, maybe. She'll probably like him when he's being good, but not when he's being naughty. Look at all the water in the back of the tundra. That's just... <sighs> I think the pigs are tired from eating all the breakfast. You girls eat too much? Morning. One of the viewers in the video the other day left in the comments that their Nigerian dwarf goat gave them the same amount of milk 
that we're getting from Willow, and they started feeding them grain, and they started getting, I think they said a quart a day. I give Willow one handful of grain already a day for every milking. So I'm going to up it to two handfuls and see how that helps. She seems pretty full this morning, which is nice. Willow is not going to be happy once there's not any more apples left. That's her favorite thing to do after milking. Look at all the apples that came down in the rainstorm. I must admit, I'm pretty nervous to look at the pasture or hopefully pasture area and see what happened with all that rain last night. Oh, here we go. It's kind of washed out. You can still see some seed, kind of in piles, but oh, that's just discouraging. You can see seed over here. Actually, the winter rye is starting to sprout. That's a good sign. See a whole big pile of grass seeds. I guess we'll leave it for now and we'll see what happens. We'll give it a week and if I have to, I'll reseed it. Maybe the rain kind of just washed a little bit of dirt over the seed and maybe it'll help it. We can always think that way. Uh, we'll find out. I want to rake out down here this morning and I'm hoping it's not going to be too muddy so this happened one other time this year, right in the middle of the driveway, big old rut. It's like, it just dumps out of the sky right there, boom, and washes that spot out. Whoa. I don't understand that. down here but pretty muddy so I don't know how much we'll be able to do today. So there used to be an old barn and farm here is what I was told. I don't know if that was for the barn door. Wonder if we'll find anything else. Well, it's definitely muddier today, but we've got a good amount done. From here, we see the dark dirt up, across, back down here. 
it's way too wet over there and down here is pretty wet too maybe tomorrow i can try to get this area after i get this seeded <sighs> it's a lot of work and it doesn't help when it gets washed out on you what do you want to make for dinner tonight pizza or spaghetti um it's a hard decision but since we can have one or the other tomorrow we'll do pizza you want pizza mm -hmm. all right what's that they didn't no it's been there you gonna jump on the spools for us? No. Well, oh, you eating the corn husk now? You wanted to wait till all the corn was gone? And there, Lynx has got some grass. Here, I want to feed the mama hen and the babies. Time to feed mama and the baby chickies. I'm gonna some more grain tomorrow. Okay, guys, you can't really see him very well. Picker's right there. I'm gonna try to hunt him down. Oh, what's he gonna get? What's he gonna get? What's he gonna get? Whee! Big row! Big row! Hello! I wonder how Moose and Andy are getting along. I don't know, Andy's always over here. They're kind of close though. Yeah. There's Moose. What do you think, Andy? You can see him touch his hair. They keep their distance, yeah. but not terribly. No chickens. What's up? Oh! Oh! She coming to say hello? I took your eggs! What about this one? That's fine. Well, she wanted to go back in there, I guess. Well, there's no eggs in that one, I guess. Good thing. Oh! <laughs> and they're like, what are you doing? <laughs> They're scaring you. Is that a good nice mud hole? You look fat and happy. All right, we're cheating. We were at BJ's the other day and they had organic pizza starter kit, three tap. Yeah, we got three crusts in there, and how do you open it? You want to squirt some sauce? Yes. You know you're a pretty good cook. Me? Yeah. I could get used to this watching you make dinner. You could? Yeah. I think this will be a new chore. No. No? Sometimes. Is that good? Looks good to me. Did a good job making pizza. You did it? I think you should make dinner every night. It's really good. Is it hot? Kind of, but kind of not.